let's take a look at cross stitch now um, a nice simple stitch not a difficult stitch but a really really versatile one I'm sure many of you have done cross stitch kits and seen cross stitch kits um, so I'll show you the stitch this is it here so a diagonal stitch one way with another diagonal stitch crossing over it the other way I'll show you the stitch first how to work that so you can come up in one corner and you really want to go diagonally imagine a square so corner to corner so that's horizontal and halfway in between that and upright which is about there take your needle down the other side and then imagine the other side of the square so there's the corner we're going to come up in our imaginary corner cross over that first stitch a diagonal stitch like that and down into what would be the other corner and there we have a cross stitch I'll just do that again diagonally you can see me laying my thread down first and that just helps me to see if it's at the right angle if I do it there it's going to be a bit a bit twisted I'm doing these straight on the on the fabric so then come across the top to where you would imagine the corner of that square to be I go down with the needle it matches there and across it matches there diagonally the other way over the top of that first stitch and if you note with my stitches now I've got three in they're all going the same way the only thing you really need to to concentrate on when you do cross stitch so make sure the underneath bars are going in one direction and the top bars are going in the other direction try and keep that the same if you can if you're doing lots together in a cross stitch pattern it does show if you get them a, a different way around so try and keep the bottom ones going in the same way and a nice stitch to do on a counted fabric if you've got a counted an even weave linen or an aid of fabric or something like that but you can do them freestyle like I am so the bottom ones going the bottom stitch is going bottom left to top right and the top stitch is going top left to bottom right and keeping that consistent and if you want to join the map you can join the map it doesn't matter if I go from that corner over there or this corner that way but I shall come up in this corner I think corner of your square and that's going to meet that one you can join your cross stitches up this is a nice stitch to learn because it comes into a lot of the other stitches I'm going to show you as well so we'll come in some of the trellis patterns and um, check out the star stitch video as well because it um, makes an appearance in that video too okay so there we have the humble cross stitch